gardening revolution is taking place and real gardening is at the forefront. I speak to its CEO, Claire Reed, to find out more. Real gardening and the app are kickstarting the planting revolution. Um, it's a simple way to get your hands growing. You don't need a green thumb to get started. The seeds are encased inside a biodegradable paper tape with all of the nutrients. It's pre-packed into a complete garden in a box kit to take out all of the uh, questions around what to plant when and where. And so all you have to do is take your garden in a box kit, follow the simple color-coded, almost paint by numbers like instructions, pop the seed tape in the soil so that you can see the colored bit above the soil, automatically your seed is planted 100% correctly. And then you open up your app and you tell your app that you've planted that seed on that day and the app will tell you moving forward what to do exactly according to what you planted and when. So really it's taking you from planting right through to harvest every step of the way without you having to second guess the process or worry if you're doing anything correctly. Now there's a lot of convenience that you've added to this uh, innovation. Why is that the case? Because a lot of people just don't get started growing because of the proverbial, I don't have a green thumb, or I don't have enough time, or I don't know what to plant or where to get started. So a lot of people are already overwhelmed before they even begin, so they never begin. And so what's happened? We have an entire society that's completely disconnected from where food comes from. So I thought if I remove the confusion and the um, stumbling blocks, for want of a better word, if I could get more people to just try, I would then get more people to connect with the soil, connect with their food, and then we would have a happier, healthier, and better fed society. Now, let's talk about the seeds themselves. Are they genetically modified or are they organic? We only use completely natural, open pollinated seed. We really want you to have the highest success rate with your seed, but we want you to be able to harvest your seed. We even teach you how to harvest your seed to replant your own seed. So um, we believe in using completely natural seed, the kind of seed that your great grandmother would recognize. Having said that, what I find very interesting about what you bring to market is that it's 100% environmentally friendly. Tell us about some of the technology that goes into this process. So every part of our packaging is completely biodegradable. The seed tapes themselves decompose, actually producing nutrients into the soil, um, enabling a water saving while doing that of up to 80%, which is hugely needed, especially in, if we look at Johannesburg at the moment with our current um, water crisis looming. Um, water is the next um, uh, crisis that South Africa is going to go up against. We really need to look at, at um, saving that resource and our uh, planting technology does that. Um, but the packaging itself is completely biodegradable. We use vegetable-based inks, water-based glues, and so really looking at leaving no trace of our packaging behind. Let's talk about the people. Who is it that we're targeting with the solution? Vegetable growing is not something that only poor people or malnourished people or people that can't afford to buy vegetables should do. Growing your own food is something that anyone that eats food should be doing. It really is about what we call the planting journey. It's the process of spending a simple five minutes every day just with your hands in the soil, connecting to nature, pausing, understanding you're part of a larger ecosystem, getting those trace minerals under your fingernails, um, understanding the time it takes to go into 
that beautiful pump, plump red tomato growing. So by the time it's on your plate, you're not going to not eat it because it doesn't look perfect. And so I feel there's a whole amount of lessons that we've missed out on, like patience, um, dealing with disappointment, problem solving, um, understanding that not everything always has to look perfect. Nature's not perfect. We don't have to look perfect. Um, that there's beauty in lumps and bumps and blemishes, and that's life. And nature growing, getting connected to the soil, the ecosystem, that teaches you those things, and it provides that pause that is so needed, especially in today's chaotic and sometimes very, very stressful, anger-filled day-to-day environment. For those out there who are keenly interested in what you're offering, how can they get in touch? How can they source more information about real gardening? So the easiest way would be to go to our website, www.realgardening, R-E-E-L, gardening.co.za. Um, we also have social media, uh, Facebook, Instagram. Um, we are very quick to respond on, on those channels. Uh, we've got an online store. Um, yeah, purchase the product that way. And you don't have to have a huge amount of space. You can live in a balcony and get growing. We have solutions that you can get growing on your kitchen windowsill. So really just get growing in any small space you have available.